So recently I've been playing a lot of vehicles that are somewhat difficult to use. And I feel like taking it pretty easy today, so I figured I would play this. This is the American M4A176, and as you guys probably know by now, the M4 is one of my favorite vehicles. So you take the M4 and give it a big gun, and it's bound to be pretty fun. The M4A1 is certainly not the fastest oh vehicle out there, but it's got a stabilizer, the gun handling is great, and of course the gun is pretty nice. So let's take it out and have some fun. But before we get into the video, it's time for the obligatory sponsorship segment. And you guessed it, it's for Raid Shadow Legends. If you somehow haven't heard of possibly the most prominent mobile RPG on the planet yet, that's genuinely impressive. It's got over 700 unique champions, a super detailed and tactical RPG battle system, incredible graphics, and a combination of PvE and PvP content. One of the strongest bosses in Raid is the Hydra, which has multiple heads. Each head is like its own mini boss battle. Here are just two examples. As the name implies, the head of suffering is all about making you suffer. It's got a special effect called Pain Link, which means that when you damage the head, some of that damage gets sent back to you. If you want to succeed, you'll need to get rid of that debuff quickly. The head of decay will try to slowly weaken your team. It does have regular attacks, but it also has a nasty passive effect. Every time you heal one of your champions, they'll actually lose max HP. It also has an effect called Life Barrier. It's a sort of shield that, if it goes unbroken, will eventually heal the head. If you use the promo code JTSKIN, that'll get you a free epic champion, Stagnite, along with a skin designed by Jontron. They've also added a new champion, Sun Wukong, who is based on the Monkey King from Chinese mythology. You can get him for free. All you need to do is log in on 7 different days between now and October 23rd. If this sounds interesting to you, use my link in the description, or scan my QR code to get free bonuses. These include an epic champion, Talia, energy refills, a skill tome, and an XP booster. Thanks again to Raid for sponsoring this video, and let's get back to it. Now, I don't want to give Gaijin any ideas, but there was at least one example of this, where they took the upper front plate off of a welded Sherman and just put it on top of the regular upper front plate, essentially doubling its thickness to, like, King Tiger levels. So, that would be quite funny at 4.7, I think. Why, you don't think an already strong tank being made into basically a 4.7 Super Pershing is a great idea? I think this Puna oh. squad needs some help. <laughs> Why do I always jinx people? <laughs> the instant I talk about helping them, they both get annihilated by artillery. That's one. Any more of yous wanna go? Ooh, hello. Um... Is that a KV-220? Yep. Yep, it certainly would appear to be. I really hope his breach is actually orange, and that's not just Gaijin trolling. Okay, he's dead. Whew. I think maybe that shell should have done a bit more damage, but... Can't expect too much when you're fighting a KV-220. It's like the low tier 279. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> that was an accident. <laughs> it's not looking too good over here. There's a PT-76. On the other side of this rock. Wait, that's not a PT. That's uh, the Chinese thing. Uh, that's unfortunate. Well, at least we both whiffed, you know? Did he scout me? I think he might have scouted me. Um. Yep. No, thank you, sir. And that's why you bring smoke. Oh, I can still see him through the smoke. That's unfortunate. Oh, they traded. <laughs> That's kind of funny. That's not funny. Why is it always Cass? Every time. I'm sure that you can probably imagine the expression on my face currently. <laughs> Uh, 
Is that a non line of sight kill? Does that count? He thought he was safe. No, sir. Yeah, that was about my guess. That's not good. What? Oh. Why would you bring that to this BR? Oh well, seven kills. We tried our best. I am bush tactics. Dog, that's not tactics. It's just an exploit. <laughs> yeah, that's about the intelligence I would expect from a bush user. I keep picking this side where I have essentially no reinforcements for my team. Did anyone go in this general direction? Let's get this flank bread. What would that be like in reality? Would that just be like the side of a loaf? Let's see, how do we want to go about this? I definitely want to take you out first. And I think we can worry about you. And then there is a tiger over here. There was. Okay, yep, there is definitely a T-34-85 that is completely unaware of my presence. I, I don't know how he didn't see me, let alone hear me. Like, I, I was moving. AV-85, maybe we can catch him when he moves. Yep. I'm playing like an absolute goblin right now, but I feel like it's justified, you know? I mean, that's basically my MO at this point. I think I need to move. I, I have upset people, I believe, and uh, not... Uh, this might be my undoing. Again. Uh. There's too many things attacking me currently. Dog, where's my team at? Where did they all go? Okay. I've been over here for like the past three minutes just... <laughs> Shooting everyone that drives by. How are we losing B? Our entire team is concentrated there. I... Dude, I don't get it. At all. Not one bit. There's some other kind of heavy tank over here. Oh, it's a tiger. Yay. My favorite. I love being trapped in my spawn. You stupid. I think you might have um overextended a bit there, my friend. <laughs> not not the brightest tiger player I've ever met. What is up with American 4.7 teams? That this is just like normal. Every game I've had, the teams have been pretty rough. Did that guy really not notice? Like, these aren't particularly tough opponents that we're fighting here, as you can see. This works both ways. <laughs> you can see me, but I can also see you. Ooh. That was a nice trade. Well, nice for me. I'm really trying my best, but I don't think we're winning this match. Consider my mind boggled, frankly. I watched this drive. See, I killed him. That was me. I did that. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I think those were meant for me. Which, I don't understand why I'm such a bomb magnet. I really don't. 
It's not like I have a ton of kills. Oh, these decals are very, very old. Yeah, I don't think that's uh, the best way to go about doing that. <laughs> oh, that's a KV-1E. Uh, let's see, if we can... Ow. If we can hit his lower front plate... Uh, I don't think he can get gun depression to shoot us. Uh, what? I... Okay. Don't you feel silly? Don't you feel stupid? I, I knew I heard something behind him. That whole engagement was something else, let me tell you. Finally killed him. Is this guy fighting... Oh, he's fighting a T-34. Um, there you go. That was a very, very wonky shot. I will readily admit. I really don't like fighting KV-1s, even with a 76. Their turrets are just so trolly. Puma, behind you, I'm pretty sure that guy just shot a friendly's corpse. What was your plan, may I ask? This Puma and I are just tag teaming, like, the entire enemy team by ourselves. Puma, no! Is he alive? Okay, he's alive. I want to keep following that Puma because we're working so well together, but... Oh. Why? Why do I always jinx them? We've certainly got our work cut out for us today. It looks like we've taken care of most of the enemy team. Oh. You need help over here, man? Yeah, I'd say so. Where are you at, you goblin? There he is. Was. I think you got one too many L's there, my friend. Besides the one I handed ya. Oh, hello. Oh, I should have let that play out. Casemate versus casemate. What? What is an LVT doing here? Bro, are you good? What, what are you doing? Now watch this drive. What is that? <laughs> Aim just a little bit lower. Too low. Yeah, I'm gonna stop doing that, I think. Oh, good. You, you sure you wanna do that? No, no you did not. That's not good. It's really not good. Well, unless they, uh, decide to throw something open-topped at me, I think this is the end of our kills. That bomb did absolutely no damage because it landed inside the church. Yeah, I'm just gonna dip. See you later, guys. Have fun with that. I think it might be prudent for me to go get more ammo. Am I really going to have to take care of these last few guys? I think eight rounds should be enough. Let's go get this victory bread, boys. Finally, jeez Louise. Is he gonna try again? Ooh, he's doing it. I'll try to more accurately third person snipe him this time. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to make it 17? Oh, that was so close. There we go. Oh my god, he's still spawning in. Brother, you gotta you gotta call it quits at some point. I was really hoping he'd crash, honestly. Well, 
there you have it. What a close match. So yeah, that's the M4A176. Obviously a very potent vehicle with the stabilizer and the 76 and the armor that can be kind of trolly sometimes. Mobility's not great, but it's also not terrible. The all-around gun handling of the M4 is always a treat. Anyway, if you guys have suggestions for video topics, leave them in the comments, and I'll see you on the next one.